Hey, yo, check this out. I'm going to address this one time, one time only, man. I feel like I'm at a point in my life I'm not going to sit here and, and let stuff just linger around. But I do feel I owe it to people to know, especially people who really rock with me, man, to know the situation that they trying to paint, the narrative they paint, this shit is false. Not no seven-on-one situation. Wasn't no blindside ambush. That's not what this is. This is family business, internal stuff that's been going on for 10, 15 years. That's probably been building up and just spilled over into shit. You know what I'm saying? And the crazy thing, I'm watching all these blogs and everybody say some of the stuff they say when they don't know. Me and this man have held a conversation for them the two hours the day after. You know what I'm saying? Probably a conversation that was needed to be had. But it's just so crazy to watch so many people try and put their two cents in and think they know what they're talking about and say this, say that. And look, I'm not on here to be trying to defend nothing. What I will tell you is those who know my character know I've always been stand-up. They know I don't do no fuck shit, man. Probably got one of the biggest hearts ever. But they also know I stand up for what I stand up on. If in any way I feel disrespected, I'm a stand up. I'm a man. You know I'm human. Sometimes we do things out of emotion that, that, that may mess us up. Sometimes we do things that we rightfully feel is right. What I can say is, man, it, the situation in this, this internal stuff, man, you know, it's crazy because we've been fighting our whole life. Our, our whole family always fight. So it's just different now because... It's always cameras and it's always social media and people with opinion. It ain't no hate for that, man. You got to understand, I'm not going, I'm never going to let nobody hurt or harm him. You know, and, and that's just as it's, it's simple as can be. As far as the blogs, as far as everybody who has something to say that I'm seeing, just, you know, you got to keep that same energy. For those who really rock with me, you know, if I let y'all down, that's on me. I stand on that and, you know, I, I accept my accountability. But other than that, man, it just, it is what it is, dog. I'm not going to let people keep adding fuel to the fire, keying it up or gassing it up. It's Bryce Davis on the check-in. And shout out to Trey the Truth, man. Normally, I don't like when dudes, you know, are beefing and go to the internet afterwards. But when you have two artists of this magnitude, you know, it's a little different because, you know, the streets get involved. There's politics. There's other things that happen you know, being a big artist, internationally known and things like that, to where us regular people. But shit, a lot of y'all go run to Facebook and, you know, cry about what happened. You know, that ain't me. I don't really like to speak on things. I get into a situation, you know, something like that. Normally, I just keep it to myself. But nowadays, you got a lot of corny dudes that run their mouth. They don't respect the fact that you're silent. So then you catch yourself defending yourself. But anyway, you know, I like how Trey responded to this whole situation. He didn't necessarily throw zero on the bus like that. You know, I like that. You know, said he had a conversation the next day. I definitely understand why he had to put the statement out there. And, you know, hopefully there ain't no retaliation. You know, hopefully this is the end of that. Because, you know, dudes got pride at the end of the day. Ah, end of the day. But, you know, if they spoke, then most likely it's squashed. And, you know, we can move on. You know, things like this happen all the time, especially in the industry. It's just nowadays everybody got camera phones. Everybody's trying to get clout. Everybody's trying to get their uh, TikToks, Snapchats popping, you know. So if you like the video, you know what to do. Like and subscribe and comment, whatever the case may be. Holla at you, boy.